Yes. What's up, Rob here, man versus pin. The other week, Silji Anderson suggested this pin in the comments. Apparently, with just some coffee, some vinegar, and a steel wool pad, you can make this awesome antique wood stain. Really? I've got all of those things. Absolutely no time to waste. As instructed, I got a mason jar, filled it up with a quarter of a cup of coffee grounds, added a steel wool pad, and filled it almost to the top with white vinegar. Then I let it sit overnight, and the next morning busted out my unfinished wood frame that I got at the craft store. I got this treble clef while I was there, because it was kind of cool. So I dumped my mixture into a bowl, and as instructed, with the same steel wool pad that I left in there overnight, scrubbed the stain onto the wood. Coffee grounds and all. Now I'm going to use the treble clef sort of as my control, and only go ahead and apply the mixture to half of it. That way I can compare the colors and see how well it turned out. After I got a good coat on it, I took it outside to dry. Upon inspection, about 20 minutes or so later, it definitely didn't look legit. It kind of looked like it was moldy and kind of gross. Upon further examination, the tiny fibers of the steel wool pad that remained on the wood were the only parts of it that were stained, so... Something's going on, it's a little confusing, but it said to add a couple more coats, so here we go. After I got a good coat on it, I took it outside to let it dry. Now this time things got interesting. It's as if the mold-like color is spreading, which is something. Whatever it was, I added another coat and it got even darker. Whatever is happening here, is happening. The wood is slowly getting stained, the color gray through some sort of chemical, reactional, scientific something or the other. As you can see by the treble clef, it's definitely staining the wood. This pretty awesome gray color. I'm pretty impressed. So I went along and decided to apply the stain to the rest of it. Fuck it. After about four or five coats and a couple trips outside to dry, I wiped off the steel wool and the coffee grounds and got this fucking awesome stained picture frame. I threw this creepy uh, picture in there of my dad from when he was like three years old in Poland. Pretty weird, not sure if I'll display it anywhere, but you get the picture. And as you can see from the back, the color difference, totally stained. Treble clef looks awesome too. I'm gonna hang that up somewhere. Maybe not, I don't know. I'd also suggest wearing gloves as the stain will stain your fingers, but whatevs. See any pins out there that look too good to be true? Let me know about them in the comments below. I'll test them. I'll try them. I'll f*** them up. Who knows? See you next week.